to our room. We had lunch, took a shower, got a drink. This is a pina colada. It's just not blended. Today was super beautiful. The water was really, really refreshing. It was hot outside, but not nearly as bad as Florida. Um, and when you get in the water, it's just wonderfully, like, it's just perfectly temped. <laughs> if that makes any sense. Like, the temperature is just perfect, and it's so blue. So pretty. It's the prettiest water I've ever swam in in my entire life thus far. So it was very enjoyable. And we got a coconut. Got to hydrate. Had those electrolytes. <laughs> so super fun. I may read my book for a little bit. Maybe take a nap actually. I'm just, I'm really tired. <laughs> uh, before getting dressed and going to dinner. We made it to Mexico, we're in Cozumel, and we're gonna do a little bit of exploring before we go on our little excursion, meet up with everybody. Yeah, it says it's 87, this is not 87, this is like 95. Okay. <laughs> you, you would know. <laughs> I would. I'm so excited! The water's really pretty. Later. This is tonight's outfit. I love this dress. It's from Express. This denim jacket is from Costco. So cute. And my shoes are from Ross. <laughs> so we got back from our snorkeling adventure. I wish I could have recorded it, but obviously it was all in the water and I don't have a waterproof camera. So enjoyed the moment. It was awesome. Super amazing. They fed us. They gave us drinks. It was really, really cool. So I didn't record like any of it mostly because I was in the water and I was wet. <laughs> um, and I just wanted to be in the moment, be present. So yeah. And now we are off to see a show. We're actually late meeting our friends. We have to go get a drink and see the show for tonight. It's supposed to be like a comedy magic show, which seems pretty cool. And then we're gonna do dinner and I don't know what else. We'll see. We may just crash because it's been a long two days in the water. <laughs> 
but the water was so beautiful, so clear, and just that wonderful temperature. Change my mind on my shirt, I'm changing. Okay. <clears throat> We're not late or anything. <laughs> anyway. Maybe she got sick and I got it from her. Who knows? So that's unfortunate. Um, but at least it's on the last day and it's just a sea day, so there's really nothing to like miss out on, you know? I'm gonna sit out here and read my book, enjoy some champagne, enjoy the last day on the cruise. Be grateful for everything that we got to experience. <laughs> Several days later. Update. Cruise day. Hello. Update. Update. It's been like three days since <laughs> our last video. <laughs> Something. Liz and I got the Rona. <laughs> hey. oh. And now we have to quarantine in Florida. You may be wondering why we have the Lucy and Ricky beds. Well, that is a question that I would like to answer. Tanya is wet. <laughs> to be fair, I did not book this, so I'm just grateful to have a bed. But I am grateful that they're separate because I've been sweating like a crazy person. Hold on, let me stop. Our cinema is going. Hold on, see? Look at our makeshift setup. Because this TV is stupid and has nothing good on it. Nothing. nothing. So we had to put this on. Oh. oh god, this is taking so much energy. Okay. So, here's the story. Morning glory. <laughs> What's the word? Anyway. I'm listening. Um... I'm tired. I'm so tired. <laughs> so Liz got it first. I got it first. Ish. I'm yeah. The winner. When we chicken dinner, and then she got like abdominal pain. So we spent the last day on the cruise, which was a sea day, thankfully, in the medical facility. And they told me I was extremely dehydrated because COVID will do that to you. Yeah. So they poked me up everywhere. Uh it poked her up so bad she looks like someone that uses like heroin or something. Yeah. Um so she tested positive first and then I tested negative and I'm like there's no way. There's no way. So the next day when we came and we landed and we docked. Forgive us, we don't know what day it is. I don't know what day it is. That was yesterday. Yeah, we went to the ER to get checked out and I had a high fever and she had all these tests done and blah blah and then I tested positive too so here we are in a hotel room in Florida I'm sweating so much and I keep getting a fever um yeah it's quite disgusting I'm sure I look like a million bucks COVID would not recommend. <laughs> Would not recommend. Not at all. No. But yeah, 
fever, intense chills, I have a headache that is basically non-stop. Like, even when I don't have a fever, the headache still is, like, right here. And then every time I cough, it goes... Bah, bah. Terrible. I'm exhausted. And body aches everywhere. It, like, takes a lot just to go to the bathroom, and it's, like, three feet away. So, we have wonderful supplies here. Mm -hmm. We have some food, but honestly, it's, like, hard to eat. Thank goodness for delivery, though. Yeah, that's so true. Otherwise, I guess we would just starve. <laughs> like, no. I would, I have no energy to go anywhere. No. Mm. So, yep, yeah, COVID. What is this, day two, day three? Yay. Yeah. All right, we're going to watch our, our cinema. Under the stars. Under the stars. <laughs> we're watching The Little Mermaid. Yay. Good night. We are finally leaving. I finally feel good enough to leave and we're going home. Thank God. <laughs>